Hi, welcome to Ramesh Soft Video Tutorials. In this video tutorial, we'll talk about uh, static versus non-static. Now see here. So inside static methods, we can access static variables and static methods directly, but we cannot access non-static variables and non-static methods. When it comes to non-static context, uh, that is in non-static methods, um, we can access static variable static methods as well as uh, non-static variables and non-static methods. Now, let me go through very basic example. Now, I'm taking one example, context to test. Now, let me take one class, class test three. Now here I'm taking, let me take string uh, name is equal to, I'm taking name as Ramesh soft. Let me make it as static. Now let me take one more variable, int id is equal to one, two, three. Now, now let me write some methods. Hello make this method as public and uh, so let me write one more method i am writing just dummy method to show the static context versus non-static context let me make it as a static now inside this non-static methods that is inside non-static context uh, we can access static as well as a non-static now s y s o of i'm printing name plus uh, id now again let me call display method display method that is inside non-static context we can access static as well as non-static variables as well as static methods as well as non-static methods now when it comes to static context uh, we can access only static variables but not uh, non-static variables now i'm calling name no problem at all because it is static now i'm printing here id i'm printing here id now see the output just put the cursor here what is the compile timer we are getting here cannot make a static reference to the what non-static field non-static field so now see here comment out it now can we call this method this non-static method inside static still we cannot call it now see here we are getting what compile time error it means um, inside non-static non context that is inside non-static methods we can access both static variable static methods and we can access uh, non-static variables and non-static methods so when it comes to inside static methods we can access only static variables and static methods uh, but not non-static variables and non-static methods now now so still i want to access uh, non-static variables and non-static methods inside static so we can access uh, by creating object of this class so let me create object of this class test 3 test is equal to new test 3 now see here what i'm doing just uh, so let me call with uh, test dot id now i'm calling test dot hello now if i run this program let me write the main method now see here let me create object for it test 3 test is equal to new test 3 i am calling test dot hello and i'm calling test dot display method now see here so when i'm calling display method it will come here and inside this uh, i'm printing name and then id and then hello let me run it right click run as java application see here what is the error we are getting so here we are getting what stack overflow because stack overflow now let me run it right click run as java application now see here in the previous what we did is we called a display right 
so first we are calling what is that hello method now it is coming here so hello method is internally calling what is that method display again inside this we are calling what hello again hello again what display that's why we are getting what stack overflow exception right now now let me comment out it right now this is the way to access I mean this is the way to access uh, non static variables and non static methods inside static and uh, we know that in order to access static variables uh, methods uh, we have three approaches directly by calling their names and by using their class name and by creating object so in order to access uh, non static data we have only one approach that is create object and then access so more elaborately we will talk uh, in the coming sessions about this how to access non static variables and how to access static variables thanks for watching the video have a good day